Hey guys. I could show you hey. Hey, AV. Hey. Hey, AV. Hey. I know that hey. Can be strong. Hey. Hey. In the real what up? Way. Hey. And I want hey. to hey. inspire hey. you. Hey. Hey, what's up? There we go. All right. So, oh, a Talisker, that's so dangerous. Um, we're not, we're, we're getting ready. We're just backstage doing some things. There's a lot of you here. That's great. Oh, are you dusting me off? Oh, you're the best. You're the best. You're so cute. Oh, you're so cute. Look at all these animals just tr trying to take your money. Cute. It's great. Let them take your money. Oh, you got Strobes' badge. Did you donate that? Not willingly. You can't just, you're a police officer. You, you stole it. You might need to arrest her. Like <laughs> no, stop. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get started here in just a second. How's everybody doing? Good, good, good. I, I'm really hoping, because the Patriots play later today, that I'm, I'm really. I know there's lots of you from lots of other places. Goodness gracious. <laughs> oh, right, we're done talking about sports. <laughs> science. <laughs> Who liked the science theme? You guys have fun with that? Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, first suitors, uh, how many of you got up to the photo room by a show of hands? How many of you got up to the photo room? Yeah, did you like the improvements this year? Yeah, yeah. Valdo, you really liked it. You're like, woo! Woo! Preaching! Yeah. Okay, good. Cool. Awesome. Um, yeah. This is great. Uh, possum, even. Man. I'm just stalling right now. That's all I'm doing. Are we good? Okay. We're good. We're, like, shrug good. That was a good little shrug. Like, whoop. Whoop. We're good. All right. So I'm going to go back here, and then we're gonna, I'm going to come back out and be more official that way. Hi guys. Oh, 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 there we go. Hi guys. Oh, are any of you guys as tired as I am? Anyone? I'm sure the 2 a.m. wake up call didn't help, huh? Honestly, that was pretty great. I'll actually get back to that. But, you know, welcome to the A&E 2017 closing ceremonies. I know. Yep, all must, all must come to an end. Well, I had a fantastic weekend. So how about you guys? Show of, show of hands. Good, good. Oh, man. What a fun, productive weekend, huh? And, you know, I could spend a long while thanking people, but we're going to try to make this quick because I know people have, you know, the Patriots to watch or the, or the Steelers. Calm down. Guys, there was more. Applause for the Pittsburgh Steelers. What was that about? Wow, all the, all the Patriots fans are actually just home. All right. So, I owe a big thank you to the hotel staff for making this entire weekend even possible. Um, without, you know, our hotel coordinators and everyone that we work with, you know, these events wouldn't be possible, obviously. And... You know, I hope that you all felt home for this weekend. You know, they worked very hard to make this your home for a couple days. And, uh, you know, we all owe them a big thank you. Make sure you tip your, your wait, sta wait staff, your uh, room service. Um, I also want to thank them for the, actually, how they handled the fire alarm. Because I don't know if you guys noticed, but between the time that alarm went off and the time most of you were all back in your rooms, it was probably only 25 minutes. It's pretty good, pretty good. And they somehow missed all the staff rooms, but I heard uh, yesterday that they provided free coffee to everyone for the, you know, the little wake up. So big thank you for that. It seems like the staff room got skipped. Yeah. But yeah, big, big thank you to the hotel for making this weekend wonderful. Um, obviously, I want to thank the guests of honor as well. Riley, unfortunately, had to go home. But we have Lady Rain here still. And, you know, big round of applause to those two for, for all the cute art, all the hard work they did for us. And uh, 
I actually want to give Lady Rain here a chance to speak because we have something thankful. Uh, we should all thank her, rather, for a little something special. So I'm going to let her talk to that. Can you hear me? Uh, okay. So I just want to say thank you guys so much for allowing this honor and this opportunity. I had to do it in suit because I'm probably going to cry with Gail. Um, but I just wanted to say thank you, and I was very grateful for this opportunity. Um, I did end up raising $500 myself for the charity from my proceeds, and it all went to Vesta Dog as a way of paying it forward. So thank you so much, Amy, for that chance. Thank you. And everybody travel home safe for me, please. Okay, I want to see you guys back here next year, all right? Yeah, so thanks again, Lady Rain. You are. <laughs> uh, so there's also one other person that I want to thank. Uh, he's not here anymore, but I want to thank a friend of ours, uh, local. His name is Ryan, or Ferris Oxide. Some of you may know him. He made a very, very generous donation um, to Mass Festa Dog of $1,000 last night. And I just wanted to you know, call him out by name and just thank him. And if some of you guys know him, you should probably thank him too. So let's give a round of applause to Ryan for that generous donation. So. I'm going to bring up some of my staff so that they can uh, say some of their thank yous as well. You know, it's not just me and guests of honor, of course. There's a whole team working, obviously the hotel. So I'm going to give some of our staff a chance to, to uh, thank who they need to thank as well. So who's first there? All right, everyone. Here is Carr, our head of volunteerism. Um, yeah, so thank you guys for helping out all the, all the volunteers who helped out this year. Thank you so much for signing up. We really appreciate your help. And also for everybody who signed up to volunteer on site. You guys are amazing. And the people who just kept working and kept working and exceeded like the 20 plus hour singe. Um, thank you. It's <laughs> Thank you, especially, so thanks, guys. Car, you can stay. Nope, he's gone. OK. You can stay. I love you, too. Gay! Hi, everyone. So I just wanted to give a big shout out uh, to all of my volunteers that we had volunteer for security. You guys did such an awesome job. The whole week went with very, very minimal incidents. Just, you know, and they did such a great job. So, I mean, I want to give them a massive round of applause for everything that they did. And I know some of you guys must, I saw a ton of you down in the game rooms, right? Yeah, anyone go to the tournaments or the game rooms? Oh, no one in here, oh, okay, a couple, all right, a couple. Well, Luno, why don't you come on up? Woo! Hi, everybody. Uh, first off, thank you to everyone who just came and played games, which is great. Uh, and donate their goods. Yes, we had some great donations in both the video game and the board game room. I want to give a big special shout out to my uh, second in command, uh, Somnius, who ran the video game room. He brought most of the stuff. So if you played something in there, it was probably his. So a round of applause for him. I don't think he's here, but still. Um, uh, and then thank you to Varga for running our Mario Kart tournament and Ryder for stepping up and running our D&D sessions. Uh, and if anyone got a chance to play any of Razlo's games while he was in the board game room, thank you for helping him play test his next game. So that's great.
And of course, all the volunteers that sat there and helped people get games. Yes. That guy. That guy. And now, uh, CL, who expertly handed registration. I never saw too much of a line. I'm sorry if people had to wait, but I think CL did a pretty good job. So let's give a round of applause for, for Reg team, huh? You're all, you're all way too kind, and you're all way too nice, and it's, it was such a pleasure to help out all of you. Um, my favorite number from last year was 965. Do you not want to do numbers? I was told to do numbers. Can we do numbers now? Yeah. No. No? 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 Okay. Right. Okay. A little bit of suspense. So we're that. my favorite number from last year was 965. And we'll leave it at that. <laughs> all right. But I just want to, I want to be a broken record and thank all of my awesome volunteers. Everybody helped out so much, and I really appreciated it. And you guys all really made this convention. So come back next year and see me again. No? Yeah, my favorite person, and I think your favorite person, too. Give it up for Teddy. I just wanted to say thank you to all of our dealers. You guys are amazing, and we wouldn't have nearly as wonderful of a con without you. And to all the volunteers that helped by the door, um, inside carrying stuff, we really appreciate it. Singe, I don't know if you're in here, but you're the best. And um, Ryan, who unfortunately has already left, but was with me the whole time and was really wonderful. So thank you. So who else has? All right. Uh, I want to thank Taz, our uh, treasurer, for you know spending a lot of time and using a lot of hand sanitizer, counting all the uh, generous bills and donations that you guys made. So let's give it up for Taz for just being the responsible, responsible person he is with uh, all of our money. Thank you all. Um, those of you who were at opening ceremonies, as I pointed out, if it wasn't for your money, I wouldn't really have a role here at the convention. So thank you. And you know, I'm really excited for some of the numbers that are coming out. I spent some time with Hunter this morning, and we, we, we found some good, good numbers. And I want to introduce someone very special to me who kind of has shied away from uh, being up here before, but uh, he's one of the directors of Anthro New England, and I want to just give a big round of applause to Ziggy. Um, I'm the only one in my department, so I'd like to thank me and <laughs> my awesome fists and don't ask about how I type with these on, I just do. It's like strong bad. Um, and that's pretty much it. There you go. And Molly. Time they, it's like the only time you were nice to me this whole time. AV, AV, that's specifically to AV. Um, I was gonna say, stop doing that. So. Ooh, you suck. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, um, I just want to say thank you guys for like being here. I mean, as no, thank you. No, no, thank you. Oi, oi, meow. Okay. Um, yeah, so as director of ConOps, I want to thank everybody that hosted a panel. You guys are awesome. 
I want to thank everybody that volunteered. You guys are awesome. I want to thank our DJs because if you came to the dances like any night, they, it was it was so amazing. I just I was in the ballroom on Friday from 10:45 to 1 a.m. without leaving. It was so good. I my feet are in so much agony. Um, yeah, AV kicking a lot of butt, kicking a lot of butt, and like I want to thank. Or, or Drac, do you have a, a mic back there that you can talk with? Well, just use everybody be quiet and use your, your end voice because we have a, a really awesome person back there and I think you would do it justice about just how awesome he is and just what he did for us. <laughs> Are you coming to me? Okay, I'll come to you. We'll meet halfway. I've been doing this thing here at a &E for the last three years, and actually this is, I think, the first time I've ever had to get, get up on stage and say anything about it. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> I've been trolling the rest of the staff from the uh, front of house booth, so that's usually my job. <laughs> um, I really want to thank my crew, uh, getting this set up as fast as we did, getting everything ready, my lighting guy, Sirius. Stand up, man. You made this happen. You were the glue that made this whole thing stick together. Without you, this would not have done what it did. <laughs> and also, um, just like Molly said again, to all the DJs that came out here, if any of you are still here, you are all amazing, and I am looking forward to hearing your sets again next year. Again, just give it up for AV. They did so much, so much work. I mean, the main ballroom has so many of the events that you guys love, and it's because of them that those events can even happen. Um, and it's because of them that we even have this microphone, and anything that's happening right now is happening. So they're really important. Um, but yeah, so basically just thank you to everyone that did anything, be it bucket brigading or volunteering or hosting a panel or just running around and seeing your friends and having a good time. You guys are what makes the con really, really fun. We're just like the background. So we, we get it to you, and then you take it and you go with it. And I'm going to say that the people that come to A&E are kind of just the best. We have like the best community here. And you guys are so awesome. And like, like Hunter said, you guys handled that fire alarm so well. So well. Pros. Pros. I actually uh, see some of our hotel staff back there. So can we get another round of applause for our hotel staff? Thank you, ladies. You two are wonderful. All right. So Twitter's pretty cool. We make a lot of our announcements on Twitter, and all the nice, wonderful things and announcements and updates you see are made by a very, very smart witty person, so I want to give all the credit and thanks to Smudge. <laughs> Cats are not smart. I thought we concluded this. Dabbing is banned. <laughs> you suck! All right, but, but, you know, Smudge, to be fair, Smudge uh, did help a lot with the tweeting throughout the weekend, as well as designing our wonderful con book this year. So give it up for Smudge. But uh, during the rest of the year and some of those drier tweets you read, I'll let, I'll let James speak to those. I'm the boring one. <laughs> no, who's excited to be here? Yeah? I'm excited to be here because Quinn the dog farted backstage and now I don't have to breathe in that stench. Uh, <laughs> absolutely serious. Um, <laughs> so I'm Logan, I do the Twitter thing. Uh, I just want to thank you guys so much for supporting us all throughout the year. Um, you know, it's kind of a bummer when you tweet into the void and no one responds and you guys make sure that doesn't happen. You respond so much. <laughs> um, I'd like to thank my phone battery. Um, <laughs> 
because that was a big help. Um, but no, seriously, thank you all so much. Um, definitely, you guys make it all worth it. Uh, you know, it's, it's, it, it really lightens my heart that you're all here. Oh, I love you all. Um, but I'm not gonna get sappy, because I have really important stuff to talk to you about. So we're good with thank yous, right? Uh, eh. Okay, right, I'm going to interrupt more real person. quick because I want to thank someone who, you know, not everyone at this convention sees, and he's a little shy to come up on stage right now. But I want to give a big round of applause and thank you to Katanu. Uh, I, don't be mad. Um, he's back there, but he does a ton for this convention between between doing the point of sales, the registration, which is completely flawless. Um, he hates me so much right now. <clears throat> Katanu, everyone. All right, everyone. Well, they dragged me up here. Well, literally dragged me up here. Um, See, I don't want to steal your thunder, but can we sneak back in with a little bit of uh, some cool information? It's not the final number. It's some different numbers. Guys, how many continents do you think we have represented at this con? Out of 40, not quite six. We have four continents represented at this con. So much. Someone came here from Australia. Is, is that person in the room with us right now? Well, I think that that's pretty cool. That, you know, we, we've got 41 states represented here. Uh, the United States, Canada, Singapore, Australia, the UK, Russia, Sweden. You guys have made this a global convention. I think that's pretty cool. I, I, I'm going to repeat what I said the first year. The only reason that we have to do this sort of stuff is because all of you guys come out here and make it worthwhile. So, you know, thank you guys for coming out here and, you know, making it worth all the effort that we put in. All righty. So, we did a Twitter giveaway. Who remembers that? Don't put it up yet. Do not put it up yet. You give me my thunder. Um, so, Denied. Oh. <laughs> All right, everyone. So let's do a hand poll. Who here follows us on Twitter? Yeah. Woo! Woo! I'm all disappointed in all two of you who do not. Um, <laughs> so how many of you remembered the contest rules and participated? Hashtag a &E 2017 posted a photo. Oh, that's so disappointing. <laughs> that didn't go the way I expected. Um, no, it was, we had so many, so many engagements. So many people were tweeting about the convention. Um, seriously, my phone is so upset with me. Um, so, but it was really cool. We had to dig through so many, and we found one <laughs> that was absolutely superb. It took the for science theme, and they took two fursuiters and turned them into this strange creature. They chopped off their heads and sutured them back on the wrong bodies. And they cut off one's hooves and put it on oh the fox's legs. And then the antlers were on, it was disturbing. No, it was beautiful. And someone snapped a picture of it and it was just too perfect. So now we can put it up because the picture's gorgeous. There it is. So, Alistair Wolf, are you in here? No? Oh, okay, fine. Well, I'm not giving you the free reg then. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. So, Alistair Wolf took this picture. They're the ones we chose for this year's photo because it's so perfect science experiment y. Uh, I love it. So, congratulations to Alistair Wolf. And thank you all so much for all the pictures and fun. I appreciate it. Now, um, I'm done talking about this year. We're, we're over this year. Let's talk about next year, huh? Who is coming back next year? Yeah! 
Hey! That's not disappointing, but I am disappointed in the two, all two of you who did not raise your hand. Uh, <laughs> no, so, so next year we, we decided on a couple things and we wanted to share them with you. So let's talk about Anthro New England 2018. All right, so we have our guests of honors lined up. And the first one's actually really cool. The first guest of honor has been supporting us basically since the beginning. They've been dealing here. You've seen them. You've walked by their table. And you definitely know the stuff they do uh, because they do a lot of printing of comics and graphic novels and furry literature. Because our first guest of honor is Rabbit Valley Comics. <laughs> And we're so excited to have them. Because seriously, they're the, the, the authors they work with, the artists they work with, they're all superb. And we're like, why would we have one guest of honor when we can have a one guest of honor that really is like 18,000 guests of honors all in one bundle? Um, but that's amazing. So the second guest of honor, and, and I guarantee you this, if you took out your phone right now and opened Telegram, you would have a sticker pack that was made by this person. I guarantee it, because they make so many of them. But their other art is really amazing as well, and we're so proud to bring in our second Riley? guest of honor. <laughs> it's not Riley. Our second guest of honor for a &E 2018 is going to be Now and Later. And we're so super excited to be able to bring them in. So it's great. We're going to see if we can get an A&E sticker pack. Because that'd be cool with our cute little deer. <laughs> what? I don't know what you want. You're a cat. Uh, so, so we're super excited to have them. Who's excited for those two guests of honor, huh? Yeah! It's amazing. We're so, so pumped. And there's one more thing that we're, we're going to be announcing for 2018. And for science was so amazing. You guys took it to the extreme. It was perfect. And then we had sports ball, right? That was amazing. I mean, who has a jersey? It was so cool. Right, there they are. So, and we're, we're really, really excited about what we chose for next year. Um, so our theme for a and &E 2018 is going to be to the sea. Um, and <laughs> it's amazing. So, of, and what's so cool is that New England has such a rich history of sailing, of nautical exploration, of piracy, and fishing. Hunter is obsessed with fishing. I do not know why. It's the most boring part of this, and he loves it. <laughs> He's like, commercial fishing, so exciting. <laughs> the buoys. Um, so. <laughs> Gail will be hosting a panel on the different kinds of buoys. <laughs> now, <laughs> we have a very close artist friend of the convention. Her name is Buban. Who knows Buban? Yay, love Buban. So we reached out to her because we really wanted to find out what the a and &E deer would look like with this nautical theme, right? So she kind of took this opportunity to dress him up in a cute little sailor outfit. And we have him for you because he's adorable. Aww. It's so cute. And the little lobster's down there with his little claws. And... <laughs> I love it. So we're so excited. Um, now and Later and Rabbit Valley are going to be superb guests of honor. We're, we're so excited you guys get to interact with them next year and meet them. And then uh, to the sea, it's going to be great. You can be pirates. You can be in the Navy. You can be in the Coast Guard. It's amazing. So we're so excited. Fishermen. What? Fishermen. Or a fisherman. fisherman. So we're so excited. You suck! So who's, who's going to be here next year repping that super cool nautical theme, huh? Yes! So that's it for me. I'll stop talking because I'm really boring. And I'll give it back to the man who's obsessed with commercial fishing. <laughs> What's your favorite trawler? So before, I'm sure you guys are all looking forward to some of these really exciting numbers. 
Your body's ready? All right, before we get to those numbers, I got a couple other numbers that I got to announce because we promised we would. We had a couple Denied. raffle winners. We had a couple raffle winners that uh, couldn't follow instructions and didn't put their phone number or name on their slip. So we had two winners that I need to announce the numbers for. Uh, the first is 5017168. So if you have that raffle ticket, you can swing on by ConOps after this and we will help you get your prize. The second one is 5017214. So if either, if anyone out there has one of those raffle tickets, let us know and uh, we'll get you squared away after the closing ceremonies. But uh, now I'd like to go to uh, some of the really exciting numbers and bring it over to Gail. So. Um, aren't we doing these exciting numbers first? Yes, sorry. Those exciting numbers first, which is SEAL. Uh, do I have to stand up? Yeah. But I won't, yes. I don't really get that much. Stand up. My, mm. Yep, come out front. Oh my god. <laughs> this is, I, <laughs> Stop this, no. <laughs> All right, uh, I do this because I enjoy it, not because I want you to clap for me, so don't clap for me anymore. <laughs> of, of course. Furries ruin everything, dude. All right, so last year we had 965 attendees. We planned this year on a 5% growth. <laughs> yeah. We hit 43% we hit with 1,384 attendees. You guys totally... Like, what was that? That's top 15 like, in the world, right? We're, we're getting there. We're getting there. My, my goal is 2030, Anthrocon, a, a, a e has their own hotel. 2030, we have our own hotel. <laughs> um, so, yeah, like, like Otani was saying, 41 out of 50 states, 4 out of 7 continents. You guys just, thank you so much, because this was fantastic. Kotano is telling me that we had over six, 600 people from Massachusetts alone. I think that's like half the state, right? So I'm just going to ask, and I've been saying it, you know, for a few months leading up to the convention, because I get, I get all the re registration notifications, and, you know, I look at them and just am in awe every time, because I'm like, oh, another Massachusetts furry, oh, another one. Who are all of you people? You know, I'll, you know, I'll actually use this chance to uh, rep some of the other events. There are some great events in, in Massachusetts alone. There's, you know, some of the other furballs, some of the other meet and greets. You know, come on out to them. Don't be shy. You guys made it here. You can make it to those. We're all wonderful people. And, at, you know, probably it's going to be difficult. But, you know, at one point, we'd like to be able to say that we know all 600 of you Massachusetts first. It'd be pretty cool. But, yeah, you know, so get involved. It's amazing to see you all here. For those of you who are curious, we pulled up the Wikifair list. We are the 13th yeah. largest convention. For, uh, for whenever uh, Scani and Olefin see this, gotcha, Fernal Equinox. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they'll get us back because their con is in a couple months. <laughs> uh, but yeah, exciting things. So this is like another number I'm sure you guys really want to hear. If, if I could get my, my folks from the charity to come on out. So do you guys uh, do you guys have anything you would like to say? Yes. Oh my gosh, I will keep it short though. So huge, huge thank you to all of you guys. Oh my God, it was so much fun. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You truly outdid yourself with generosity, with loving, caring, kindness. More smiles per day than we see the 362 days of the rest of the year. So thanks for charming us up with all the smiles and joy and fun we had today and, oh, and over the weekend. Um, 
A special thanks to Lady Rain for her generosity, turning over all her proceeds to Bass Festa Dog, $500. Um, there is a gentleman, I didn't get his name, who does massage therapy that turned over $250. Thank you very much to him. Woo! And to RJ, Thank you, thank you, thank you. $250, profits donated to us. Thank you, thank you. Um, whether you put in some change or a couple of bucks or bought raffle tickets or bought shirts or whatever the merch that was that you got, whether you participated in a free drawing, whether you held up the selfie frame. How many did the selfie frame? I love that. Yeah, wasn't it fun? Um, of you that raised your hands, how many posted it somewhere? Instagram, t t tweet, whatever. Uh, excellent, good. Keep posting them, you know? Keep, keep, the, keep the love alive. So uh, anyway, I want to say thank you so much. It was a lot of fun to bring the canines here, um, to meet and talk with all you guys and see so many of you again and meet some new friends. And look, I, I, they're doing the selfie thing all over again. I love it. And a huge thanks to the staff again. I know everybody's thanking the staff, but they are truly the best. And Miss Molly, by golly, I love you. I love you you. Can I be really, really corny? Really, really corny? The Lion King. Can you feel the love tonight? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Absolutely. So anyway, um, can I share the numbers from our table? All right. You knocked our socks off, folks. I do have them on, but they were knocked off. Um, we broke the records this year. At our table, including the raffle, we raised not 3,000, not 4,000, not 5,000, but $5,400 in three days. Thank you, thank you, thank you. A huge thanks to my awesome staff. I have Josh, Michelle, Diane, and Quinn, and I don't have Michael Lee or Priscilla and a few other folks that did a lot of stuff behind the, the scenes here in order for us to be here and have all the fun stuff that we had to make sure that you had fun and could have fun because if you don't put fun into fundraising, you're not doing it right. And let me tell you, we rocked it this weekend. Thank you so much. Oof. Yeah, there you go. All right. And Miss Molly, you got a bigger number to tell me, though. All right, I'm going to turn it over to her. All right. So, yeah. Oh, man. So, first off, thank you again to Ferris for donating $1,000. That's, like, amazing. So, can I get one more round of applause for Ferris? That's, that's crazy. And a huge thank you as well to all of my fuzzy friends that were bucket brigading around because just bucket brigading, you guys raised $1,600. So I'm sure you guys remember that we made that little bet, as we do, that if we got to 12K, we would, we would have to pie some staffers. And then we were like, well, you guys should vote in case that happens. Well, I'm not at the number yet, but I can tell you that we're over 12K. So I can tell you that we're doing the stunt. So as I'm talking, could my, my staff here move those shares to the front of the table? So we also decided that we want have the top five voted for staffers get pied because three was just not enough and we had plenty of shaving cream to go around. So the people getting pied are Fuse. <laughs> and Carr. And Smudge. <laughs> yeah, yep. And Hunter. Yeah. And 
me. <laughs> so now, I'm gonna ha probably have James help me out a little bit with this, but like I said, we had a lot of, lot of shaving cream to go around. So something I'd love to see happen is... Uh, thanks, Duino. Yeah, thanks, Duino. You're the best. How was, how, how'd your panel go today, the pie throwing 101? I, I bet. <laughs> Smudge. Also, does, does anybody have like a, like a, a t-shirt or a tank top we can tie around Smudge's eyes so it doesn't get in the nice fursuit eyes? I mean, not, you don't have to just, nope, stop. <laughs> um, if one could be found, that's great. Um, I'm sh I sure am happy that I'm already sitting down <laughs> because <laughs> uh, the just total charity number is crazy. But I also would like, if there's anybody willing right now, $20 right now in cash, if they have $20 right now in cash, if there's five of you, if you'd come up here and Talascar and Bacani will take your money. Come up here, Bacani, Talascar. Anybody with $20 right now, he gay? He gay? He gay? He gay? I, uh, just the first five people to come up here. Rain. 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 Miles. Miles. Okay. Okay. No more people. No more. Oh, wait. No, no. The people that were already up. Camaro, guys, you can come up. You can come up. No, no. Come on. Come here. Come here. Were you coming up to give a 20? Yeah, come on up. Okay. Okay. So if you just put a 20 in their buckets, could you uh, stand over by Cyan and Dalmi? All right, could my backstage staffers get all of these lovely people a pie? Uh, I'm so ready. I'm so you want to? Oh, lovely. Now, for my lovely people that just donated $20, I want to make sure that each person up here has at least one person pieing them. Don't throw the pie. You can just stand on like either side of it. We'll spread the chairs out. Yeah, actually, that works. We'll move the chairs forward, but somebody helps Smudge because he's actually blind. <laughs> um, so yeah, if you just paid for a pie, go choose somebody, and uh, whoa, don't die, Smudge. He's so blind. Okay, nope, 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 nope. He's so very blind. Okay. So, we'll add that, those, those, those monies to this number later that you guys just donated, because I can't math right now, but I want to let you know that we will be donating. Oh, no, ready. Oh, okay. Don't throw, just, okay. The number is, drum roll please. Fifteen thousand. Oh yes, I can give a countdown. <laughs> Should I start at 30? No, I can't. 30. 60. 60 is a good number. <laughs> All right, we'll do five. Ready? Everybody together. Ready? Five. Four, three, two, one, pie! Sending it out. Oh, you, should we say something? Hi, Smudges. Oh, Lord, you. Smudges. Oh, Logan, come here. No. You look like you look 
Now, we have one more thing. So we know that some of you may not necessarily have cash, but now you may be feeling particularly generous. Um, on our website, we do have a donate button at the very bottom. You can go there and donate online through, your, uh, through credit or debit information. And with a small transaction, besides a small transaction fee, all of your donation goes directly to Mass Vesta Dog. Um, so certainly donate online if you'd like. We'd love to have more money for the doggies. But um, I, our chairperson and our MC are both currently uh, not able to speak. Although, hold on, let me get you a microphone, Hunty. Denied. Is this on? Yes. <laughs> Would you like to close it out? Thank you guys for coming. We love you all. Unfortunately, Anthro New England 2017 is now closed. Denied. <laughs> but let's end it on a high note, everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you all. Damn cat. Thank you, everybody. If we could have staff members hang back, but the rest of you are free. Run. Go, Never look better.